Welcome to my add-on series. This is episode number four, and today I want to go over one of my favorite PvP add-ons, and that is Kill Counter. Now, Kill Counter is a very straightforward uh, add-on. It's going to track your kills, your deaths, uh, your AP gains even, uh, and it's going to do a couple really cool things, including tracking uh, how often you're killing in that session, your overall, and even players that you're killing or dying to, and it kind of gives you an idea of what's going on. So with that, we're going to jump right into the game, and I will show you kind of the stuff that it does in-game. All right, now that we're in-game, let's take a look at what this add-on actually looks like. You can actually see it in the bottom right-hand screen, part of my screen, right here. Uh, what you've got is your kills and your deaths, so you can see that. Your KDA is right next to it. Uh, killing blows, killing blow streak, and your streak and your AP. So let's take a look at it. So when you first click in... You can kind of see your stats overview, how many kills, how many deaths, your streaks, your death streaks, your KDA, AP gained, um, killing blows, um, and your longest streak. Uh, even keeps captured, resources captured, resource streak, keep streak. Um, this only records if you've got the add-on on. So if you haven't had it on, you're not going to have a lot of this data. So next is the current session, which right now is empty, but you can kind of see it'll tell you who... Uh, kills, killing blows, deaths to them, class, and alliance. And it kind of gives you an idea of what, what's going on in that session. Kills, um, you can kind of see real easily a lot of uh, kills that you had. Uh, you can sort it by total kills, so uh, you can see who I've killed quite a few times. Killing blows, you can sort it. Um, revenge kills, um, avenge kills, uh, classes, which is just going to be a big list, and then of course alliance, or by player name. Um, then you've got killers. Um, these are people that have killed you. So you can take a look. You can see who's got kills on you and how many kills on them uh, you may have uh, in that case. Uh, and you can start by kills on you or kills on them. Uh, then you can go into the stats breakdown. Uh, it'll show you most killed player, most uh, killing blowed player, uh, total unique players killed, which is actually more than I thought there, uh, how many alliance kills you have. So which alliance you're killing more, most classes killed, uh, your biggest killer, your total unique killers, most dangerous class to you, alliance, um, and then it kind of breaks down the different uh, alliances that you may be killing. Uh, so as you can see, for me, I kill everyone into Necros. Necros the least because, well, they've been out the least amount of time. And Templars happen to be something I kill a little bit easier than anything else, I guess. On the flip side, sorcerers tend to be the most dangerous thing to be followed by Nightblades on this character. Uh, killing blows, you can kind of take a look at your killing blows, what is causing it. Uh, so if we flip over, Impale, which is an execute, there should be no surprise this is my biggest killing blow. And then Swallow Soul, Light Attack, and it kind of goes down on what's doing it. Um, you can also look at your least one, which is going to be a lot of little things. <laughs> Um, and then there's settings, right? You can turn on different announcements, um, I see flag alerts, all this kind of stuff. You can keep it on or off as you want. Uh, the nice thing is, if you have this on, it'll actually automatically accept you in a Cyrodiil, so you don't have to do that. Uh, so this is uh, just a fun uh, add-on I like for PvP. It helps me keep track of everything that's going on, and I can just jump into uh, this and kind of get a rough idea of what's going on for my character. Uh, that's it for this uh, episode on the add-on series. Uh, you should probably grab this, especially with Mid-Year Mayhem coming up. It will help you out a lot. Uh, that's it, and I will see you soon for the next one.